Security Technology Firewalls and VPNs by Christian Fabropura. Introduction. The technical controls are essential enforcing policy for many IT functions that do not involve direct human control. Technical control solutions improve an organization's ability to balance making information readily available against increasing information levels and confidentiality and integrity. Access control. Access control method by which systems determine whether and how to admit a user into a trusted area of the organization. Mandatory access controls, so-called max use data classification schemes. Non-discretionary controls, strictly enforced version of max that are managed by a central authority. Discretionary access controls, so-called DAX, implemented at the discretion or option of the data user. Identification. Identification, mechanism whereby an unverified entity that seeks access to a resource proposes a label by which they are known to the system. Supplicant, entity that seeks a resource identifiers can be composite identifiers, concatenating elements, department codes, random numbers, or special characters to make them unique. Some organizations generate random numbers. Authentication. Authentication, the process of validating a supplicant's purported identity. Authentication factors, something a supplicant knows. Password, a private word or combination of characters that only the users should know. Passphrase, a series of characters typically longer than a password from which a virtual password is derived. Authentication factors, something a supplicant has Smart card contains a computer chip that can verify and validate information. Synchronous tokens, asynchronous tokens, something a supplicant is relies upon individual characteristics. Strong authentication. Authorization, authorization, the matching of an authenticated entity to a list of information assets and corresponding access levels. Authorization can be handled in one of three ways. Authorization for each authenticated user, authorization for members of a group, authorization across multiple systems, authorization tickets. Accountability. Accountability, auditability ensures that all actions on a system authorized or unauthorized can be attributed to an authenticated identity. Most often, most often accomplished by means of a system logs and database journals and the auditing of these records. Systems logs record specific information. Logs have many uses. Firewalls prevent specific types of information from moving between the outside world and trusted network and the inside world trusted network. Maybe separate computer system, software service running on existing router or server. Separate network containing supporting devices. Firewalls processing modes. Five pro processing modes by which firewalls can be categorized. Packet filtering, application gateways, circuit gateways, MAC layer firewalls, hybrids. Firewalls processing modes. Packet filtering, firewalls examine header information of data packets, most often based on combination of internet protocol, source and destination address, address direction, inbound or outbound, transmission control protocol, TCP, or user data datagram protocol, UDP, source and destination port request. Simple firewall models enforce rules designed to prohibit packets with certain addresses or partial addresses. Firewalls processing modes. Three subsets of packet filtering firewalls. Static filtering requires that filtering rules governing how the firewall decides which packets are allowed and which are denied are developed and installed. Dynamic filtering allows firewall to react to emergent event and update or create rules to deal with event. Stateful inspection firewalls that keep track of each network connection between internal and external system using a state table. Application gateways. Frequently installed on a dedicated computer, also known as a proxy server. Since proxy server is often placed in unsecured area of the network, it is exposed to higher levels of risk from less trusted networks.
Additional filtering routers can be implemented behind the proxy server further protecting internal systems. Circuit gateway firewall operates at transport layer like filtering firewalls do not usually look at data traffic following between two networks but prevent direct connections between one network and another. Accomplished by creating tunnels connecting specific processes or systems on each side of the firewall and allow only authorized traffic in the tunnels. MAC layer firewalls designed to operate at the media access control layer of OSI network model. Able to consider specific host computer's identity in its filtering decisions. MAC addresses of specific host computers are linked to access control list ACL entries that identify specific types of packets that can be sent to each host. All other traffic is blocked. So here, here are the firewall types and the OSI model. So application gateways consist of application, presentation, session, while the circuit gateways transport packet filtering is network, data link, data link itself, and the physical. Hybrid firewalls combine elements of other types of firewalls, elements of packet filtering and proxy services, or of packet filtering and circuit gateways. Alternately, may consist of two separate firewall devices, each a separate firewall system but connected to work in tandem. Firewalls categorized by generation. First generation, static packet filtering firewalls. Second generation, application level firewalls or proxy servers. Third generation, stateful inspection firewalls. Fourth generation, dynamic packet filtering firewalls. Allow only packets with particular source destination and port addresses to enter. Fifth generation, kernel proxies specialized from form working under kernel of Windows NT. Firewalls categorized by structure. Most firewalls are, are appliances, standalone self-contained systems, commercial gradle, grade firewall system, small office, home, so-called SOHO, firewall appliances, residential grade firewall software. Software versus hardware, the SOHO firewall debate. Which firewall type should the residential user implement? Where would you rather defend against a hacker? With the software option, hacker is inside your computer. With the hardware device, even if hacker manages to crash firewall system, computer and information are still behind the now disabled connection. Firewall architect architectures. Firewall devices can be configured in, configured in a number of network connections. Architectures. Best configuration depends on three factors. Objectives of the network, organization ability to develop and implement, implement architectures, budget available for function, four common architectural implementation of firewalls, packet filtering with routers, screen host firewalls, dual home firewalls, screen subnet firewalls, packet filtering routers. Most organizations with internet connection have a router serving as interface to internet. Many of these routers can be configured to reject packets that organization does not allow into a network. Drawbacks include a lack of auditing and, and strong authentication. A screen host firewalls combines packet filtering router with separate dedicated firewall, such as an application proxy server, allows router to pre-screen packets to minimize traffic load on internal proxy. Separate host is often referred to as bastion host, can be rich target for external attacks and should be and should be very thoroughly secured, also known as a sacrificial host. Dual home host firewalls. Bastion host contains two network interface cards, NICs, one connected to external network, one connected to extern internal network. Implementation of this architecture often makes use of network address translation, NAT, creating another barrier to intrusion from external attra attackers. A screen subnet firewall is the dominant architecture used today, commonly consists of two or more internal bastion hosts behind packet filtering router. 
with each host protecting trusted network. Screen subnet performs two functions. Another phase of DMs is extranets. SAX servers. SAX is the protocol for handling TCP traffic via a proxy server. A proprietary circuit level proxy server that places special SAX client side agents on each workstation. A SAC system can require support and management resource beyond those of traditional firewalls. Virtual Private Networks VPNs. A virtual private network is a technology that allows users to establish a secure and encrypted connection to a private network over the internet. VPNs are commonly used to enhance privacy and security when, ac when accessing the internet, especially on public or untrusted networks. Key features of VPNs include encryption. VPNs use encryption protocols to secure data transmitted between the user's device and the VPN server. This ensures that even if the data is intercepted, it remains unreadable without the encryption key. Anonymity and privacy. VPNs hide the user's IP address and encrypt their internet traffic, making it difficult for third parties such as ISPs or, ha or hackers to track their online activities. Remote access. Organizations often use VPNs to provide secure remote access to their internal networks for employees working from remote locations. This ensures that data transmission is encrypted and secure. Bypassing geo restrictions, VPNs can be used to access content that might be ge geographically restricted by making it appear as if the user is accessing the internet from a different location. And this all, thank you.